We're here today on the third day of World Ag Expo in Tulare, California. And a regular exhibitor here is South Dakota State University and the South Dakota State Dairy Development Team. And with me today, I'm happy to introduce Dr. Vikram Mystery, who's head of the Dairy Science Department at South Dakota State. They've got a remarkable program, and he's going to tell us a little bit about it. Doctor? Yes, uh, thank you, Joel. I'm really happy to be here with you, and thank you for having me at this just beautiful location. So yes, we are the SDSU Dairy and Food Science Department, and we are here in collaboration with the South Dakota Department of Agriculture. And, and we're here for a number of reasons, just looking at dairy development in South Dakota, but also uh, trying to recruit students to SDSU for studying dairy science as well as, 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 well as food science. And, and there's a reason why we're here. The dairy industry really has been, has been growing all over the country and in South Dakota in particular, and what we have to offer at SDSU are some programs that lead from the farm all the way to the table and beyond, and providing just incredible job opportunities for, for, for graduates um, and, and, and in dairy production, which is the farm side of, of the business, dairy manufacturing, which is the processing end of the business, and food science, which, which goes beyond manufacturing and looking at other, other dairy products. Uh, other food products outside of outside of dairy and so what we are able to do is to provide students with that complete spectrum of of dairy all the way from farm to the product but the important thing for for students that are looking at this is just the amazing job opportunities placement is a hundred percent for all, all students many of them have three to five job offers uh, very good job offers all over the country, and so they're really in the driver's seat. And so with our teaching and research programs that we have and extension programs that we have, we're able to provide this nice, really nice package uh, for, for them. And, Doctor, while you're working closely, obviously, with the uh, South Dakota Department of Agriculture, uh, you recruit students from around the country and you place students uh, around the country too. I believe that's the case. Tell us a little bit about your student activities, uh, how many students are involved and what your recruiting efforts involve. We have approximately 115 students in the program between our three majors and we have students at the undergraduate level that come from about 15 different states and I think it's four different countries. So we have students from all over, all over the United States that do come specifically to South Dakota to study dairy and, and food science. And how do we go about recruiting? This is an example of recruiting. So we come here with the Department of Ag every year. We spend uh, this, this week here at uh, Intolary at the World Ag Expo, and we have spoken to quite a few quite a few students, prospective students, and also dairy farmers. But we also, another example is we'll go to the World Ag Expo. We have, we have right now a social media campaign going on where uh, interested students uh, can, can see us in detail uh, through social media about our programs and about all the opportunities available. We do visit high schools, and then we also have a lot of one-on-one. -on -one. But some of our best are our own alums. You know, the alums have had such an, uh, just a, a very fulfilling careers, and they go back and talk about what the opportunities are to other students, to their own families, to other friends, and that's that's been a big source. And uh, the other uh, avenue is our own students as well, who have some some good experiences with the program and beyond, and they they recruit on our on our behalf. Thank you very much, Dr. Vikram Mystery, South Dakota State University Dairy Department. We're at World Ag Expo in Tulare, California, and this is Joel Hastings for This Week in Dairy and DairyBusiness.com. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you.